My wife and I uh, were the founders. Um, Jen is the executive director here on a day-by-day -day basis. Uh, we realized that there was a need for um, some facility for homeless men. There was no facility in town for a homeless man to go to. And we got together with uh, six other residents in the city and uh, incorporated Samaritan Ministries, raised funds, purchased this building, renovated the building. That was about an 18-month process and then uh, opened in uh, November 2007. Uh, we provide the basics, uh, uh, food, shelter, lodging, uh, clothing, uh, at no cost to the men. Uh, those are the, the number one things that we do. Uh, additionally, um, we're focused more on the long term than the short term. Uh, we we want to meet those immediate needs uh, for homeless men, but we're really focused on uh, the long term, helping that man get off the street, helping him address what the issues are. And then we have a resident program, uh, and that's really where we address what's going on in the man's life. If he wants to turn his life around, get off the street, he can stay with us for six to 12 months uh, and, and work on those issues, and we help him get, uh, uh, get back on his feet again. I was once a recovering meth addict, and I've got five years clean this February. I started here four years ago, so being able to see these guys and where they are in their lives kind of helps me remind me where I don't ever want to be again and I want to be able to give back to them what was given to me. I'm a recovering alcoholic now and it just hurts sometimes when I think about it, so okay. Um, I'm a human being just like everybody else, but I have a problem with alcohol, so. But <clears throat> Samaritan Ministries has helped me um, being an alcoholic, I thought God didn't want to have anything to do with me, you know, because I was a, a low life, you know. Um, but I learned differently when I came here, and He does, He wants to have a, a life with everybody. He wants everybody to believe in Him, and you know, uh, we're all equal in His world. So, um, but I mean, it, it's it's woken me up. It's um, it's it's cleaned my mind up, you know, as far as the religion part of it, the Christianity which is great because I needed it. I didn't know that at the time, you know, I just thought, you know, like I said, I thought I was too low for him. But um, it's just changed my perspective on life. We, we've served since we've been open in 2007 over 1,750 different men. Uh, we would love to say that every man is a success, came in and left a success. I can't say that, honestly. But we have so many um, men that have come in who have said, I've had enough with staying on, living on the street, I want to address what's going on in my life, 